Welcome back everyone to our Veteran and Military Spouse Entrepreneur Awards. Hi, I'm Stephanie Brown, CEO and founder of the Rosie Network. It is day four of National Veteran Small Business Week. And in honor of this week, we have been announcing two to three awardees each day. All of them are veteran and military spouse owned businesses. Today, we're excited. We get to announce our franchisee owner of the year as well as our health and wellness professional of the year. I'd like to take just a moment and thank our sponsors. Our special guest today is Sarah Steck with Fisher House. She'll be announcing our awardees. Sarah? I am pleased to present the award for the winner of the franchise of the year. The winner is Sport Clips Haircuts, operated by Joe Klimek. Joe has worked tirelessly in the Sport Clip system to grow the greater Houston market. He is valued and appreciated by Sport Clips and his team members for his leadership and his role within the system. Joe credits his military service and shared my time serving in the U.S. Navy was a very positive experience for me. It was in the military that I learned the importance of working as a team and developing leadership skills to help our teams achieve our goals. My military service has helped me in my Sport Clips career in many ways. So much of what we do is about developing teams that work together and that have respect and trust in one another. Congratulations, Joe. Hi, my name is Joe Klimek. I'd like to thank the Rosie Network for the 2020 Veteran Military Spouse Entrepreneur Award for Franchisee of the Year. I've been a part of the Sport Clips franchise system since 1999, first as a team leader, and then later 2004 as an area developer, assisting other franchisees in developing their own paths to becoming small business owners. Nationally, Sport Clips is dedicated to assisting veterans and spouses through many of its own programs. For example, Help a Hero, supports service members and veterans through a scholarship program and has awarded over 1,750 scholarships to trade schools and post-secondary schools totaling $8 million. Once again, I would like to thank the Rosie Network for this award and their support of all military veterans and their spouses. Congratulations, Joe, for being our Franchise Owner of the Year. Next is our 2020 Health and Wellness Professional of the Year. The winner is I'm Able Foundation, founded by Chris Kaig. The I'm Able Foundation removes obstacles that prevent people affected by disabilities from being physically active by providing grants, resources, fitness opportunities, and motivation. They change attitudes about the potential of disabled individuals by redefining what is possible. Congratulations, Chris. Hi, my name is Chris Kegg. I was extremely humbled and proud to be nominated by the Rosie Network. And now that I've received the uh, official nomination, thank you so much for selecting me to join the ranks of some pretty amazing individuals uh, doing great things after their military service. Uh, I'm a Marine Corps veteran and now the founder and CEO for both my for-profit Core Fitness and my nonprofit, the I Am Able Foundation. And in both, I am able to uh, provide opportunities to redefine possible for people of all abilities, uh, both physically or cognitively challenged, as well as able-bodied. And that has pro provided me the opportunity to continue to serve and is the reason, biggest reason, I continue to uh, uh, be motivated to do a lot more. Th thank you so much. Congratulations, Chris. On behalf of Fisher House Foundation, congratulations to all the nominees and award winners. Tune in tomorrow for the announcement of the Veteran-Owned Business of the Year, Military Spouse-Owned Business of the Year, and a special presentation of the Rosie Network's 2020 Admiral Circle recipient. 
Thank you again, everyone, for hanging in there with us. Tomorrow is the last day of National Veteran Small Business Week, and we will be announcing our Veteran-Owned Business of the Year and our Military Spouse-Owned Business of the Year. So please tune in. You can follow us and watch on Facebook, LinkedIn, or Instagram, 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I'll see you tomorrow.